Hey guys, Sam Martin from Tech Fusions here, and today I've got some great news. The Suphone i5 is working again, so there we go, it's up and running, and I will show you how I got it up and running in a second. So I've got the Suphone i5 working again. Now I made a video saying that it wasn't working. Thank you for everyone that commented and all your suggestions and help. Apart from the people that saying, oh no, you should just buy an iPhone 5. Look, I got it working, so I don't need to buy an iPhone 5. But yeah, thank you for your comments. Um, Dan, I know you are a major commenter on the thing. Other people as well, they'll be on screen. Thank you for commenting and helping out. Um, I actually got this working. Now you're going to be like, Sam, enough jibber jabber. How did you get this working? Well, very, very simple. I got a new USB cable from eBay and it's from this seller and he is a trusted seller and he does really high quality lightning cables so there we go here's a lightning cable that works only works one direction <laughs> one direction um, one way so if I plug it in should be able to hear the tune there we go that's plugged in it's still coming up USB device not recognized so I don't know how to fix that I'll get around that somehow but it's charging as you can see look 95% and I would really recommend getting a USB cable from this seller if you're in the UK or anywhere just you just have to try a third party USB cable rather than an official Apple one because this one's really high quality if you can have a look there you go but this one I bought this one as well came the same day this one's really poor quality if it focuses just take it now this one's really cheap, but look at that, it's like all dirty and crap solder, so I wouldn't recommend that seller. But you just got to try, you just got to buy a few. It was only like £2.17 um, I think it was. It says it in the description, the link will be in the description as well. But here's the one, the Suphone one as well, that it came with, and that just broke instantly. That one's pretty crap as well. But this quality one is really good. So here's this uh, Suphone i5. And I'm going to be showing you some gameplay as you waited quite a long time. So let's play 10 for run to see how it works. I'm so happy that I've got this working. I'll be able to do a review on it. Do a comparison to the Samsung Galaxy S3. Compared to the iPhone 5 as well. Um, any other videos. More gameplay videos. Anything. Um, please tell me in the comments down below. And I hope this um, helps you out with your Suphone. It's a simple fix, and I didn't think it was going to be that simple as buying a new cable. But there we go. As you can see, it plays games actually really good. Temple Run is the boss game. But yeah, um, as I said, the back is still coming off, the logo and whatnot. But it's all working, all good. When I turned it on, actually, it said... Um, and go back, don't want to play this. Yeah, when I turned it on, it said Android upgrading. Now, I don't know what I did, but it said Android upgrading. Didn't upgrade anything. What I did to turn it on, I plugged it and leave it about a minute, and then hold it down the power, the minus, and the home button for about five, six seconds. Just keep holding it down until you see the Apple logo appear, and then just let go, and it boots back up. So I hope you get your Suphones working, or if you've got a problem with your Suphone i5, please comment down below, I'll be more than happy to help. I did buy the tools and stuff to open it, but um, the cable came, so I tried the cable first, and it actually worked. Um, hope this was helpful to you guys. Again, thank you very much for commenting, subscribing, and supporting me along to get the Suphone iPhone working. I look forward to bringing you content on this amazing phone and other technology Please comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.